Number 11. Unreasonable results. Letter A. Find the voltage near a 10 centimeter diameter metal sphere that has 8 coulombs of excess positive charge um, on it. All right, so let's just, uh, we're going to do this fast. We're going to do it fast, right? Fast. So uh, it's 10 centimeters in diameter. It really doesn't, uh, it, you know, there's a couple of ways to look at this. So it's 0.1 then meters. We know that on the surface of it there for, you know, it has uh, 8 coulombs of excess charge. Pretend we zoomed out of this, though, like a, a decent way. If we zoomed out of it, wouldn't it look just like this with a single point? And we would say that that point has a charge then of 8 coulombs. So it's basically this sphere is essentially considered a point charge. Okay? So now the question is asking, you know, what's the, uh, uh, find the voltage near this sphere, okay? Or, you know, close to it. What's the value? I don't know what it is. How close do you want to get? I have no idea. Right? It doesn't say. But what I do know is this. The voltage at a distance to some charged object is found by taking the following formula, that the voltage found at a certain distance relative to a charge is going to be equal to the electrostatic constant multiplied by the charge of that object divided then by the distance between that object and the point of interest. So for example, if I want to find the voltage produced, let's say, at this particular point right here, then I got to know this distance, I got to know the charge of this object, and that's it, because we know K, right? We know Q then, and we know R. So what do you notice about this formula? As we get closer and closer and closer, meaning as R gets smaller and smaller and smaller, as R gets smaller and smaller and smaller, V gets larger and larger and larger. As R, you know, approaches essentially zero, what does V approach? It approaches infinity. So, I mean, that's kind of what's basically more or less, I guess, unreasonable. We can talk about other things, why it might be unreasonable. But again, you know, if R is... Um, base, you know, if R is a fraction, 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 fraction away from the charge, then V is going to be very, 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 very large. And it's just, it's not going to make any sense. Okay. But that's what, what's unreasonable about it. I don't know. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Please remember to help us out and subscribe. See you in the next one. Take care.